Hello everyone, it's Anthony from Anthony Vlog. In this video, I want to discuss the uh, Bebop 2 motors. There have been questions about swapping the motors around A and C. What that means is the motors on the diagonal sides, A's and C's, or clockwise and counterclockwise. The uh, the propellers rotate for the uh, for the front. They rotate. They spin outwards, like that. And for the back, spin outwards again. So all four of them are spinning outwards. To generate thrust. Can we swap the propellers around A and C? No, because the motors, the A motors have a flat top and you can only use the propeller that doesn't have a hole in it. And you can put that there on the A. You can also put the, um, the C propeller uh, on the A motor and that I think is a flaw with Parrot's design but you cannot put a an A propeller on a C motor mainly because the the shaft is sticking out of the motor so there's no hole here for the shaft to go through so it will never lock onto the screw in case you're wondering why you can't push it down that is probably why you probably have an A propeller on a C motor. So when they come shipped, you notice the color coding. Blues are for A and yellows are for C. And they come with propellers as well. And the propellers have the stickers on them. If your propellers don't have stickers when you buy them, then I suggest you buy original propellers. Okay. Back to the main topic of swapping motors. Can I swap motor if I have a damage on my drone, my Bebop 2, and there's no A motors to buy, and I only have a C motor? Can I plug up my C motor in the position where the A motor was? And the simple answer is yes, it will connect. This is the connector from the motor. So it will connect on any of the motors, A or C. I don't know why Parrot did not um, sort of make it only one fit specific but uh, that's the answer it fits will it come on will it power on and fire up um, absolutely so what we'll do is we'll do a test with an a motor on the correct place and i know what some of you are going to be asking but i've seen some people do it but what if you change the motor cage and put a uh, C motor cage on an A motor, will the motor spin the right way that A does? Well, we'll find out now. So now I've got A motor on A on the correct place. We'll see the rotation. Let me take off. Take off. Yes, I know, that was my fault. I should have held the bottom. Okay, so it did spin the right direction because, of course, that is the right way to go. That was a uh, error 2 motor cutout. Well, that was my fault for not making it straight. So, to confirm, the right direction is inwards towards me. Now, I've swapped the motor cage around this is an a motor but with a c cage so let's see if it spins in the same direction as a or does changing the motor cage also change the direction of the motor okay so we'll just plug this in and for this one i will hold it it's not going to get my fingers. That's okay. So it should be spinning this way, upwards towards me. That is the right way for this position. But since I'm using a C, will it spin the other way? And if it does, then yes, you can swap the motors around. But we'll find out now. So... Just to <laughs> recap, this is an A 
motor, but I've removed the A motor cage and I've put a C motor cage. So we'll see if it spins in the same direction as A, or does it spin in the direction of C because it's following the magnetism polarity instead of the, uh, the DC power polarity. So we'll just try to take off and see which way it goes. Alrighty, take off. And... Unfortunately, an A motor with a stick at the bottom will always spin anti-clockwise regardless if you change the motor cage so can it connect yes will it work no and if you insist on doing that then you have another problem of the propellers because you have clockwise propellers and anti-clockwise propellers so if you're putting them in the wrong place and they're spinning the wrong way you're going to get reverse thrust instead of pushing the drone off the ground it's going to be pushing the drone towards the ground so i hope that answers the question about the motors on the bebop and will they work if you swap them around no can you actually connect them yes they will connect because the connector fits but just because it fits doesn't mean it will work. There's also one thing I wanna do, uh, share with you before you leave, is when you dismantle your Bebop, if you're changing your frame, um, or if you're doing some sort of repairs and you completely remove the, the cross frame off, remember that when you put the drone back together, the cables uh, that go to the bottom legs, they have to be crossed on the inside before they go out. If you don't have an X, with your cable, your rear legs, inside the central frame, then you're doing it incorrectly. So, I hope you enjoyed this video and you've learned something. Um, if you have any questions, put them in the, the, the comments. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like this video, the other one also works well. Until next time, fly safe and God bless.